Hello everybody! Welcome to Pads Tutorials How to make a flat Minecraft world Okay, let's get started First, you gotta open Minecraft which is pretty obvious actually you gotta log in go to single player make a new world I'm gonna do creative you can do whatever survival hardcore you want uh, let's call it flat world create a new world bam here is the world, yay, it's generating, blah. So, now when you got the world all generated pretty nicely, a little bit, come on, generate just a little bit more, okay. Um, when you got that, um, pretty okay uh, generated, just close Minecraft, close everything, and open your NC edits. I will leave a download link to the MC edit in the description below. So if you want to download it, just go in the description below and download it. Okay. If you don't have it, of course. Now, what you're going to do is press load world, take your world, which in my case is the flat world, load it. Here I am. This is the world I just generated. Or as far as it got with its generation. You can see that there's chunk missing here. No big deal. Okay, so I wanna first I wanna fly to this corner. Select this block. Then go to the uh this corner over here. Oh no, don't generate more. And uh, go. Oops, wrong button. Oh, I really need it. What am I doing? Okay. Now, um, let's go all the way to this corner. And select all of that. Now, you have selected a huge area of many chunks. Now you gotta lift this up. As far as you want your uh, ground layer to be, which at least has to be on top of every tree top and all that, because there it will be in the way. So I'm gonna do it like that. It should be good. Then you wanna come underneath here. And do it all the way to the button. Bottom, bottom, sorry. Um until the bedrock level, you know. Now, what you want to do next is go to this little thing here and press delete blocks. Bam! It might be a little bit slow if you've got a slow computer. Otherwise, it shouldn't take too long. And you got this empty world here. What you want to do is press here, fill in a replace. And here you can choose your block. There is every block in Minecraft, including saplings and all that. But I'm gonna choose. Uh, let's let's take um, choose something interesting. Shrub, tall grass, sticky piston. No, you know what? I'm I'm gonna go with uh, sandstone because I feel sandstone. Okay. Now you can see it's like flashing in the sandstone color here. So all you gotta do now is press fill. This might also take a little while depending on how fast your computer is. Mine is pretty fast so does the job pretty quickly. And as you can see now Oh crap. <laughs> no. Um 
Okay, I gotta lift this up a little bit more. Because those came in the way here. Now, now let's do this again. Fail and replace. Whatever, fail. Alright. Okay, there you go. Um, so now I got a completely, or not completely square, but almost, almost completely square um, blob of sandstone here. Pretty cool, all right. Now, what you want to do, because your spawn might be underneath of the surface here, you want to uh, press move spawn point, and I'm going to put it right there, because that seems like a good spot. And move player, also on top of that. There you go. Now, you can save it. Which might take a while, because lighting 359 chunks. Saving, blah, blah, blah. It's going to do uh, all of those things. But, hey, you're going to get a completely flat world. For me, this is going to take, uh, well, as you can see, it's about, oh, four seconds. Okay. Oh, no, I don't want to move the player. What am I doing? I don't want to save that. Okay. But when you have done, with, are you done with everything? Uh, uh, when you, oh my god, I can't speak. Talk, dude. When you are done with everything, um, doing this, you can just do quit. Uh, remember to save if you've done anything new. No, I don't want to save because I did that fail there. And uh, now your world should be saved. So go to Minecraft. Log in, of course. Oh my god, what's going on here? What the? Okay, I have no idea what that why that happened. That, that has never happened to me before. Then you go to Flat World. Place our selected world. And... What do I see here? Uh, what do I see here? I see... I see lots of sandstone. This is... This world is now completely flat. But, I want to show you... That it's not flat forever. It's just flat... Um, all the way until... Your blob ends, which here the normal Minecraft ge terrain generation starts. So yeah, that's how flat it is. Well, this was a missing chunk, so that couldn't be flat and blah blah. But yeah, you got a flat world pretty much. But if this is not flat enough for you, this is not a tutorial for you. There, I bet there are more tutorials on how to get them completely super flat the whole world change the generation code or something but this is this is uh, good enough for me at least and um, yeah so guys if you liked this tut uh, or if you learned something from this tutorial um, make sure to leave a like a comment and if you have any suggestions on further tutorials, take the link in the description to go to my website's suggestion page where you can leave all your su suggestions for further pad tutorials um, on diff whatever Minecraft related thing you can think of. And I'll try to do my best to fulfill that wish or thing or whatever you want me to make a tutorial on. So guys, that's about it for this tutorial, and uh, goodbye. What the fuck?